let's look into the agenda for today's session today we will be learning about while loops so what are while loops why do we use while loops and how do we use while loops so let's move on so while loop is basically very much similar to for loop the difference is in for loop you provide the condition within for for i uh, in range 0 to 100 like that but in while loop what we do we first basically assign a value to a variable then we use it as a condition in while loop and according to which we create a loop then we can use while loop if we want to perform any task several number of times like if we want to print hello a number of times and we can also use conditions as well uh, like and and or using relational operators like and and or and so syntax for while loop is while then we give a condition and then we need to give a statement so let's quickly move on to jupyter notebook and i'll show you how basically we can use while loop okay so i have opened my jupyter notebook let's re uh, rename the uh, notebook as while loop okay so when we create a while loop what the first thing that we need to do is we need to assign a assign a value to a variable which we will be using in the while loop so i'll say while and then i have to provide the condition i'll say i smaller than 10 smaller than 5 and then i'll say print hello and i'll say i is equal to i plus 1 so when i will be equal to 0 then first it will check the condition i is smaller than 5 yes we know that i is smaller than 5 then it will print hello then it will go to the condition where it will say i is equal to i plus 1 now my i will be 1 and then it will compare so let's run this code and can you see i got hello 5 times now i'll show you one more thing so if i'll use i equal to 0 and then i'm saying while i is smaller than 5 i'll say print hello uh, this time what i'll do i won't print hello i will print i and i'll say i is equal to i plus 1 write 0 1 2 3 4 because the value of i is getting increased because of this statement now in a case where we are not providing such a statement i equal to 0 while i is smaller than 5 and I'll say print i. Now I am not providing any closing condition for the loop. So can you see the loop is going till infinity because the value of i is not increasing and it is always lesser than 5. So this loop will be an infinite loop and it will not stop. And it has my kernel has just hanged. okay so understood so what we can do in this case is i is equal to this time i'll say i plus 2 and now it will print 0 2 and 4 okay now let's try another one i'll say i equal to 0 i'll say j, j equal to 0 i'll say while i is smaller than while i plus j is smaller than 10 print what I'll print I'll print I comma J so there is an invalid syntax because I forgot to mention colon over here and I have done one more mistake so this should be 0 not O oh so again I did the same mistake I this loop is going to infinity here i'll do i is equal to i plus one i is equal to i plus one i'll say j is equal to j minus one let's try this so it will also go till infinity so i'll say j is equal to j plus one j plus two so now can you see zero zero then one two then two four then three six now three plus six is nine now after that i will be is equal to 3 i will be is equal to 4 
and j will be is equal to 4 plus 2 j will be is equal to 6 plus 2 8 so 8 4 12 so which is not satisfied in the condition so it will exit the loop so we have to provide a condition such such that there should be a statement for which it will be able to exit the loop otherwise it will be going till infinity fine so uh, practice while loops and compare it with for loops you take the same condition and do uh, take the same question and try for loop for it and try while loop on it then if you have any question just let me know till then see you goodbye